life is a really big inspiration for me. Like everything, everything about life, the good and the bad and everything in between. Hi, I'm Paris Jackson and this is On The Rise. I think I've always called myself an artist because I've always been interested in artistic things. I just remember being surrounded by paints and canvases and things like that. I was always painting and drawing and, and trying out anything right brain related, but it wasn't until a few years ago that I started calling myself a musician and kind of owning that. I don't know, I can't see myself doing anything other than art. It's the only thing that's ever really come naturally to me. I had always been passionate about it, but making that decision to kind of dive in was, uh, it was a gradual thing, figuring out that music is what I wanted to do. I think my first musical performance, I don't know, like a school talent show when I was 16. Other than that, my cousin would throw a thing called the, uh, the Canyon Sessions where just a bunch of musicians would get together and play their latest stuff for each other, which is like a safe environment for other artists. That was like the first proper show I think I ever had. I have two biggest highs so far. The first one would be playing a small acoustic show in Paris. A good amount of the crowd was singing my songs back to me. Even some songs that aren't even out, just stuff that I posted on Instagram, like of me singing at home, people know the lyrics to it. That, and then also I just played Fallon yesterday. That was very exciting. I don't even remember what my first acting role was. Honestly, I spent like my entire life performing in some form or another. From like day one, I was taught how to perform and how to behave. So like I, like there's no like first set experience, I don't think. There's always been cameras around. There's always been, you know what I mean? My first celebrity crush. Probably either like Mods Mikkelsen or Beyonce. Other than the fact that Beyonce is absolutely gorgeous and talented and a really kind human being, there's just like an energy there. I take it back, Peter Dinklage. I just remember seeing Penelope when I was really little and just being like, there's something about him. And then I grew up and I saw Game of Thrones and I'm like, oh, he's still got it. Like there's just something special about him. Yeah, I mean, the most exciting part about social media and growing a platform is I get to use it for, for positive things, you know? The bigger the platform gets, the more people I can reach. So when, when things go badly and there's some petitions that need to be signed and some uh, messages to be spread and some activism, you know, I can reach more people. In five years, there's no specific place I see myself at. I just hope to continue to have the willingness to grow and learn and to grow further into self-love and happiness and helping others. So it's more of a state of mind than an actual physical place.